After one to three years in the ocean, adult steelhead trout return to the freshwater streams and gravels from which they emerged. Steelhead enter large freshwater tributaries in the fall where they spend the winter. Some fish will wait until spring to join the early migrants. Steelhead enter small streams to claim spawning sites during early spring. The female steelhead, called a hen, prefers a nest site with cool, clean water and enough flow to penetrate the gravels and reach her eggs. The hen prepares a nest, called a red, by excavating a depression in the gravel with her tail. Red construction can take hours or days. She works in an upstream direction and lays eggs in the mound of gravel that is formed downstream of her. Fine sediments and debris are displaced and broadcast downstream of the red. The male fertilizes her eggs as she lays them. The fertilized eggs are covered with loose gravel during the female's digging activity. Spaces between the gravels allow fresh, oxygenated water to reach the eggs and waste from the incubating eggs to be removed. A small percentage of steelhead, known as kelts, survive the spawning event and migrate back to salt water. Some of these fish will return to spawn again in the future. After emerging from the red, juvenile steelhead remain in the freshwater stream for up to four years. Then, during spring runoff, they migrate downstream to salt water where they will mature into adult steelhead. <laughs>